<laughs> hey guys, um, yeah, you're probably wondering what the flip in the hell is that like? Um, sorry, that's my, that is my lamp. <laughs> because it's night time now. Yeah, anyway, I just wanted to make this video for that I finally, me and my friend have finally came together and made our first ever couple of videos. So, um, I'm going to edit them and then I'm going to upload them. The, the part will be up in like two days probably. Um, could be a bit, like a long time. Actually, I might upload them tomorrow and then they could be up. Hopefully. They're quite slow when you're uploading. You know? <laughs> it's actually how dark it is there, look. It's so dark. I just think that's out there. And yes, I got horrible plaps in my hair. Please don't be mean. My ears sore today. So, yeah. Anyway, so me and Kay have now made our cooking pops actual like talking video thing. Oh, I'm so happy. I can't wait to put it up with your freaking nutcase in it. We do giggle a lot, but don't worry, our videos will get so much better. And then we will, like, you know, then we'll calm down. Well, not calm down, like, we'll still be freaking crazy, but we'll try and keep the laughter to minimum, you know what I mean? Um, it was really good fun today. We were at school, as you can tell when we wore my shirt. Anyway, we were at school, and because uh, we had two exams, Miles exams, and we finished them like, they get like four o'clock So, um, yeah. Uh, what was I saying? <laughs> anyway, yeah, we were at school, and we decided I brought my camera. And I was like, oh, I brought my camera. She's like, oh, that's great. Maybe we can make a video. And I was like, yeah, totally. So you'll see us like doing some really rude shit, and the lighting's not really good in some of them, like at the start of the second, third. And I got like you know, I'm going to edit them together, film them. Um, so yeah, some of the thingies aren't good though. Like, um, the lighting and stuff, and sometimes you can't really hear us, and, yeah, there's some, there's a thing that we got onto at night, but, um, I hope that loads of parents see, because it's really good for children, you know, who believe in Santa Claus, you know, um, we messed around with it, like, we were messing around like freaking big kids, but we were asking the most funny question, but, you know, I hope parents see and see, like, like, all the stuff that you can do on it, you know what I mean? So then, you know, that child can, I guess, play on it, you know, chat to the elves, as so I say. Um, you will see the, the um, you'll see the, what do you call it, the web link, or whatever you call it, the link thingy in the video. Um, and I upload it, because I go, okay guys, this is just for you guys and stuff. For any parents who to look at that cut on my face, mm, my face, my skin will be bad today. Anyway, um, so yeah, I hope you guys like my video and please, if you have a friend who like loves funny things, and get them on to me and Kay's site, okay? Because, like, we need as much love as we can get, you know what I mean? And, like, I really want us to get the amount of views that I want us to get. I think it'd be fun. And I'm planning to do media, which is going to be great because then I can, like, edit our videos, and which, you know, I think they'll be, like, the cherry on the ice cream, as I say. So, you know. Yeah, we're trying to come up with a new, like, logo thing, you know, like, the thing that we can just say in the, during the videos, like, at the start of the video, and, like, now I would just say, like, now I would just say, well, just, hey, here's the Cuckoo Pops or something, or the Cuckoo Pops here, or whatever, or boo, you know, we do that boo thing, you know, and you, instead of us, like, turning the camera, we actually go, like, oh, boo, you know. Anyway, so, I got, I actually think that my Miss Lee Lockett channel is so serious, you know, compared to what we were doing today, you know, with the, Fucking crazy chat and shit. It's so wrong, so random. Like, um. Anyway, it's weird that I'm so serious in this. You know, usually I'd be good, but I can't really be crazy without a friend. You know, 
You have to buy yourself crazy. <laughs> Unless you want to do something where you don't give a crap and then you just do be crazy. So I don't really know how many people like my whisper before. Um, I can't see. <laughs> you probably see in my eyes that my whole eyes have gone blacky. I wonder if I can fix this thing. Like to like show me but not shine my god down loud. There, is that better? I think it's okay. I think you can see my face, can't you? Yes, good. Anyway. So, what was I saying? Oh my god, I'm so bad with memory. I think I need to go for like a cat scan or something. Get my brain cat. Oh my god. Um, yeah, I'm putting my arm down in the store. Um, I have definitely lost it. I'll probably look back on this video and realise what the freaking hell I was. <sighs> Jesus. Oh my god, I've lost it. <laughs> I really have. Ah, damn. Well, I know I was saying something about us being crazy and stuff, and I'm so serious in these. And that you do need a friend to be. to like have crazy and stuff like that. I did video a bit um, in our cookie pop thing, it might be the first thing I did. Oh ah, well. It's not a freaking thing you bedtime, you know? You'll have to look perfect. Anyway. So, um, yeah, I videoed um, me and my friend Kay. We were walking down the shop, which is going to be hard, maybe our second video. Um, we're all going down to the shop, we're like, we're going down to the shop, and the sun was beautiful today, today, at that time, so it looks really pretty. And we're like, oh, we're walking down the shop, and it could be a bit shaky, because we were walking down the steps like that, you know, it was like fun, and we got up. so, you know, and, <laughs> you know, um, yeah, I've got two lights on, look, I've got that one on, that one on, it's terrible, like, my light, my light, that one there, it's Um, I don't know what else to talk about. Okay, I forgot. My skin is really bad today. Oh my god, look how red my face is. And then I've got like really cuts on my, well not cuts, sorry. Like spots and stuff all over my face. Look, that one's really bad. I'm sore. My ear hurts today. You know this here person? Because anyone not these, that, Apologies for my crap plot, like, it's just my bedtime plot, I guess. I got my neck crazy, it's pretty. It's pretty. It's a good look one. My auntie got for me, it's a shamrock and stuff. It's like, lucky, I guess. Oh my god, I got like, I need to lose weight. I really do. You know, I'm talking about this camera like an actual person, but I think I need to lose weight. I'm, you know, my dad's like, oh my god, you're, you're thin enough, like, you know, you don't need to lose any more weight. And I'm like, my face looks so fat. Every time I do that. See, every time I do that. Look, oh my god. Like, that should not even be that. I should be, like, be able to do that there. And I get that in it, you know? I'm talking to a camera about being fat. What the fuck? Like, I know people should be appreciate for like who they are and stuff. I you know, I have friends who aren't perfect, you know what I mean? So I know I'm not perfect. I know I'm not perfect. You know, I hate my ears, you know. Like they stick out in my hair sometimes or I hate my mouth, you know. I don't know. I just don't like whenever I smile like this. It shows my gums. I hate it. So I just smile like that. Sort of a fake smile because I usually smile like that. Like, that's the way I use smell it. But they used to show my gums, so I was like, you know, I'm going to smell like this. So, but, like, nobody's perfect either. Like, like, I've got a horrible, like, chest and all, you know, it's really, like, really acne prone, I guess. It's not acne, yeah, okay, acne. You can't really, yeah, you can kind of see it, you know. You usually see it in my videos, you know, you see, like, me with a big red chest. It's not really my fault. Like, you know what I mean? I don't like my body either. I don't really like my legs because they're horrible. See, like, you know, if a guy says to you, like, oh my god, you're so beautiful and stuff, and they're just like, oh my god, no, I'm not, you know? But, you know, these days I just kind of figure it out. If you don't accept those compliments, the boys are going to be completely pissed and just going to move on to some other girl. So I think you should have accepted them. Like, I'm talking about loads of bullshit here. I really am. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just skipping through things that are running through my head today. <sighs> oh, I just find that today. I find out the dates 
that I'm going away to Spain on. Hey! I'm going on the 15th of July. That's a Sunday, I think. And then we're going back the Sunday after. So we're going a week after we arrived with the Sunday. The week after. <laughs> whatever, the week. <laughs> you know, whatever. So it's Sunday. So. Okay, so yay! I can't wait. I'll probably come back and I'll probably be like tanned, hopefully, or burnt to a crisp. I really hope I will be, and I hope I get a tan because if I don't get a tan, I'm gonna go back there and sue the sun <laughs> if it's possible. Um, I don't know where it's all about. Yeah, I want to talk about us being perfect. Like, no, girls can't be perfect, girls can't have like the amazing boobs and the amazing body and the amazing legs and the amazing face, you know, flawless and the amazing hair. Because every time, like, you see them then when they take off their makeup. <laughs> they've got like pimples like the size of your freaking hair. They have like the black bags under their eyes or the hair is dead, you know? So like even though it's like what they call it, the Kardashians, you know, you see them and they don't they don't like my sister is watching the live eyes and they start wiping off their makeup and you see that their face their eyes are like all red from all the makeup and they've got like you know, like who was it? I don't know which one it was now. But they had like really red face here and like all spots and stuff. And now it's like you new know, acne kind of, well not acne really, but like sort of like acne looking kind of thing. And I like, see they're totally not perfect, it's just like, the makeup's like a layer like this thick so you can't see anything. <laughs> I'm joking. But like, you know, I don't know how makeup does that. My makeup never covered up my, my pimple fingers, they make, kind of make it like, make them look really, my face look really dry sometimes. And maybe I need me a new makeup, like maybe I need me to your makeup, but I can't afford your makeup. And I don't really think, I don't really like makeup, you know. And that's what those people say, they're like, I can't live without my makeup. And you're just like, makeup doesn't make you perfect, love, you know. You, know, you show off your flaws, it's like, I can't believe I'm videoing right now, and it's like, whatever time. And I'm videoing with this here thing. My whole chin down here is terrible. And my head here is really bad, you know. Just, I guess, you know, I don't really like makeup. I wouldn't put makeup on just to make a video. <laughs> no way. No way, Jose. Definitely not. So, I really what I'm trying to say right now is that nobody's actually really perfect, you know. You see all these actresses and shit, but you don't really... Oh, I just swore again. I'm so sorry. You see all these actresses, you know, and you're just like, oh, I want to be like them. But what you don't realise is that you know, they go to take tanning salons and stuff and they go and get like laser, you know, hair removal treatment and they get like wax and, stuff, and then they get like, what else do they get? Like, they get their hair done and like this sort of stuff put into it to make it look alive when it's actually like looking freaking dead. And they like, you know, you, know, you gotta think about it. Maybe they are thin, yeah. Some of the people get themselves photoshopped and they're actually not that thin and they look like bloody... Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know how to explain it, but photoshop really, like, pe like these your men think, well, people who own, who do the photoshop, I'm sorry, for celebrities, they're just like, well, you know, a celebrity has to be perfect, they have to be a perfect role model, but you know what, I think the best role models would be the ones who... Like, who don't want to be photoshopped, the ones who show off their flaws, you know, like, who show off their, if they have, like, um, if they have, like, a little scrunch whenever they sit down in their tummy, or if they have, like, um, or if they have spots on their face, or if, I don't know, like, you know, flaws that we all have, you know. But you know, they they always cover them up. Like they all photoshoppers like put make their face look flawless. Like they get rid of all these. They make their eyes look amazing. They make their hair look awesome. Make like you just want to say, oh my god, how did they get their hair like that? When you realize it's just a wig or it's just something that they added in. And then you see their body, and you're just like, oh my gosh, that is awesome. Like, her body's epic, she rocks a lot. Like, I know Nicki Minaj is not photoshopped, you know? And my sister's like, I want her body. And I was like, I think 
um, I just let mention oh well, as you may you know, every girl wants to have well not every girl well most okay every girl to say every girl wants to have her body because you know she's got a perfect body but you know magic you know she probably had to work for that she had to work for her body I'm talking low crap I think I need to stop talking that every day because I'm sure she's gonna say something and it's gonna be weird oh I know. I'm writing a book, well not a book, a story, like a big story, and my mum's like, if it's good enough I'll send it away, and I was like, sorry, she's like, if it's good enough I'll send it away, and apologies for the yelling thing, and I was like, send it away to work, and she's like, somewhere where they make books famous and stuff, and I was like, you can't really trust anyone these days, you know, with it, because you know, there's so many people who fake website you know so I was like oh okay yeah but I was like you know get a proper site don't get like one of those crappy ones that look fake and are completely fake as you can tell you know like they have to have that little what they call safety thingy or something on the bottom it has like a little safety lock or something on the very bottom of the screen something like that this bubble's massive look <laughs> it's the only one I had and this one's like really tiny do you see any difference? I think I do. <laughs> anyway. So yeah, I'm writing a story. And it's about... It's called From the Future. Ooh, future. And it's by a girl. Who, well, she's not from the future. Alright, it's based in 1985. 1985. And it's a girl... And she's all like a dancey girl. You know, she goes to like college of dance and stuff. You know, college of performing arts, whatever you want to call it. College of dance, I call it. And um, her friend and her, just like nutcase, you know, crazy people. You know, she like actually says goodbye to a poster of a kid, thinking that if she says goodbye to it, she'll find a man who wants to buy her one. Yes, that's actually why I wrote in it. Anyway, and then everything starts to change. And suddenly she starts seeing the sky. Like, you know, like, not like seeing him, like, going out. I mean, like, she keeps seeing him around, you know. So she's like, this is freaky because he's watching me, you know. And then it goes on to, like, I don't know if I should read you some of it or not. I don't know. Maybe I should. Maybe I can read you some of it. Um... It's like I've got it wrote down here today. My little notebook. Um Okay, I might read you like a small bit of it. Tell me if you like, okay. Um This is from the future and it's like my little sneak peeks. Uh let's see. Look, the future isn't like today. It's horrible. Many people die every day and this man won't stop until he gets you. And when he does, he will kill you. Without thought, Michael said, holding Laura against the car. Shut up, she yelled, pushing him away, making him fall. Then she ran. Laura, Michael, Laura, I can't even put this on. I'm sorry, I'm kind of abandoning my spirit, but never mind. Laura, Michael yelled, running after her. They jumped on her, making them both fall into an opening in the bushes. Laura, 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 <laughs> I don't know how I said. Oh, Laura, like, you know, yelled. Michael yelled as she hit and kicked him. He pulled her up and shot to snap her back into reality, but then she smacked him. Michael got so mad, he pointed the gun at her. Ooh, scary. My mum says it's okay this one. I'm gonna make some improvements. This is just ideas, right? Go on, shoot me, shoot me, Laura screamed. Michael realised what he was doing and lowered the gun. Can't you see I'm scared, Michael? Laura said, beginning to cry. Michael? Laura said, wondering why he wasn't talking. He was looking at something on the floor. Oh, looking at something on the floor. You know, this isn't this isn't there in the future. This or this. He said, beginning to cry when he seen a daisy flower. Laura got onto her knees and moved closer to Michael. It's so hard to know that I could never see this, he cried. 
Laura comes around him. Come on, Michael. Let's go. Laura, Michael, Laura said he didn't mean it. I don't know if I should go on for trying as long as you already. Maybe I should. Should I? I don't know. I look green. Don't they? I look green. Unless it probably changed when I put this on YouTube. I actually think my eyes look really green, but they're actually blue. Anyway, um, I'll just read a bit more. Laura tickled his ribs. He began to laugh. What's that? He asked. Laura. Oh, he asked Laura. It's a new form of torture called tickling. Laura joked. Well, I think I like this form of torture better. He said, suddenly falling over because of the tickles. Laura sat on top of him and continued tickling him. He spun her so she was on the ground. And then he tickled her. Stop, she laughed, and then pulling him close to her. When he lost his balance. Doesn't make sense. Ahem, someone coughed. It was an old couple on a walk. Wait. On a walk, Michael quickly jumped up, pulling Laura with him. Hello, Mike. Oh, hello, Michael said nervously. Hello, son. The old man smiled. <laughs> so you can, you can tell that this guy doesn't know what flowers are, I guess. What land is. Whatever. Okay, I'll read the rest of this part now. When the elderly couple went past, Laura, went past, Laura began to laugh at Michael's face. Michael just looked at her, wondering why she was laughing. You're cute when you laugh, he smiled. Laura looked at him and smiled back. You're cute when you smile, she said. Slowly, his hand slipped into hers. Come on, we need to go, Michael said, walking with Laura back to the car. As as they came back to the parking lot. Oh, wait, holding her. Wait, okay, I didn't get that right. Said, walking with Laura back to the car park. As they came back to the car parking lot, then... Bang, that makes no sense, I'm sorry. Bang, the car exploded, throwing Michael and Laura back with bits of the car. Yeah, that's that part done. And then I've got like so much more behind that, but I'm not going to read it to you because I need to go to sleep. Because girls need their beauty sleep. <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to go now. I'm going to listen to probably Gentle Whispering, fall asleep to it, and wake up tomorrow fresh and happy. And then I'll make another video. This one's long enough, though. <laughs> Just be honest. This is long enough. So, it's long enough to do for, like, five days. So, sorry. I'll see you later. Okay? Enjoy my videos. Enjoy the cuckoo pops whenever I put them up. Because I'm so excited. Anyway. So, bye-bye, guys. Bye.